Good morning, New York traders. Risk off theme still intact at Privateer FX. We've been 2600, 2620 in the S&Ps. We're dead in the middle now, 2610. Dollar Yen has been, oh, I don't know, 40. 70, 40, 71. We're at the high end of this at 68. We have a confluence of crap coming up because we have quarter end fix. We have Easter holidays to deal with. We have chart signals that are risk off, but we have a low participation rate because so many dudes are on holiday. So this as always, won't be easy, won't be clear cut, but a couple of setups worth looking at. First is CAD Yen, 81.68. This is a proxy for risk off, obviously. We have a nice little technical setup here on the candlesticks. Dollar CAD should be bought at uh, fix today. Um, so this could help CAD Yen lower. And the second one is Euro Yen. Same type of idea on a dollar buying fix. Euro should go lower. We like dollar yen to not make new highs just because it's risk off. So euro yen gets thumped. We've had the miracle print at 60 today. Now we have one, two, three, four, sort of five lows at 60. We have the 200 hour moving average at 43, which depending on how you look at it, is a problem because it's supportive or will add to the misery once we break it and CTAs will enter into shorts or cut longs. Anyway, we think the number is going to be 59. Um, so there you go, CAD Yen, Euro Yen. As far as Dollar Yen is concerned, uh, we still think this 30, 105.30 is the bull bear pivot. The problem is, is the dollar buying at the fix. Uh, so, I don't know. Volatility in dollar yen has been pretty crappy recently. So let's uh, let's see how that goes. Quickly to Aussie, we got what we wanted today. Uh, through 75, worked. Hasn't gone very far, 10 ticks. Uh, but this is sell on rally today based on risk off and fix related flows. Kiwi, we stayed away from, but you could argue the same idea on Kiwi. Uh, this is probably more of a sell on rally than a, you don't want to sell high ones instead of sell low ones. Uh, but same mentality plays. Euro Swiss. Don't ask me why, but it ripped today. You see the high at 117.94. Looks like people just jam stops above 80. Now we're right back down, but this could be dollar Swiss buying, pre buying. We broke these highs here, 95.09. Um, I don't know, but I just wanted to mention Euro Swiss ripped. In general, what we're looking for is. Prices below 2600 in S&P minis, you want to hammer. We will close below 2585 in the next couple of sessions. This will lead to 50 handles lower, and we will, we will take a look at these yearly lows of 2530. Guess that's about it. I mean, can't be any more simple than that. But of course, we all know this would be much harder than that, that one sentence. There should be some stops above S&Ps above 2623. Got to keep this in mind. We really don't think it's going to trade above 40, so this is kind of where our where we're going to kill this strategy if we get back above 2640. Um, all I can say, I guess, is good luck. Uh, we think this is going to be risk off next couple of days. So, and it probably starts at the. Um, 3.30 at the uh, Dow Jones Industrial Average opening bell. Good luck out there, guys. Talk to you tomorrow. Ciao.